Hello everybody, Sephiroth4 for the weekly update. My hair is a mess, I'm sorry. Um, so this week uh, is not much. Um, should be regular schedule between um, uh, Wind Waker and uh, Does Near Door. Uh, the only thing is that at the end of the week, well technically at the start of next week, uh, is a Jewish holiday. Uh, it's going to be going in from, it's going to be starting Saturday night and going into Monday night. Uh, it's two days, so it's going to essentially be three days because Saturday I'm not here. So Saturday, Sunday, Monday, I'm not going to be around. Uh, so I'm going to do my best to have next week's Monday Thousand Year Door recorded uh, and uh, have that go up at its normal time, but there's not, not going to be like a weekly update next uh, Sunday. Uh, I'll probably just do a Tuesday morning. Um, and yeah, uh, Saturday's videos should also be up as normal, but we'll see. Um, and before I get into anything else, uh, this Friday is going to be an event known as Sticker Fest. Um, John, one for ones, uh, is doing a charity marathon, I believe, uh, from 9 a.m. to 9 p.m., not 12 hours on Friday. Uh, raising money for uh, Child's Play Charity. Uh, he is going to be playing Sticker Star, Paper Mario Sticker Star for 12 hours, I think. So um, that's going to be an event. Uh, it's going to be over on his Twitch, which you can follow in the description. Um, and uh, yeah, so look forward to uh, follow his Twitter and whatever um, for details and stuff. But uh, it's going to be on Friday. Uh, and hopefully we'll be raising a nice amount of money. I'm, I'm probably going to be joining in at some point, um, probably earlier on in the marathon since I'm not going to be here at the end of it. Uh, but uh, yeah, so I look forward to seeing you guys there. I'll definitely at least be in the chat. Um, but uh, it's going to be a thing and hopefully hopefully there's going to be like donation incentives to screw with him. It's going to be great. I saved up money. Um, but yeah, so that's that. Uh, let's see. The yeah, so Paper Mario and Wind Waker. Um, having a lot of fun with Wind Waker. I'm having actually having more fun with Wind Waker than I thought I would. Um, yeah, I always knew that I loved the game, but I didn't. It's been a really long time since I had played it, so I didn't just. I I didn't take into account the nostalgia bomb that it is, so I'm just, like, really enjoying it. Um, same with uh, Thousand Year Door. I've just played that more recently, so it's not, like, the same, like, oh, man, that right, this and this and this. Like, I remember it more, so uh, it's nice. Um, so I was going through my stuff. Uh, I have, like, a whole load of, like, if you guys have seen over the years, uh, I have a lot of like collector's editions of video games and they usually come with art books. And one of the reasons why I collect it is because they're full of drawing references. Um, so I actually like yesterday went through uh, a whole bunch of my stuff and got out a whole bunch of the art books, like the Persona 5 book that I'm waving around here. Um, because like they're, you know, drawing references for like, you know, drawings and you know, they're, they're on paper. So it's easier to to eyeball, you know, as you're trying to draw. So I'm gonna be using this. I have my Danganronpa uh, 3 1. Uh, I have some Fire Emblem stuff and a whole bunch of others, a lot more um, that I'm gonna be hopefully using uh, in the future. Not the immediate future necessarily, but in the future to um, draw some good stuff because there's just a lot of like pictures and concept art and things. Um, I have one for Xenoblade 2 that I would like to use, uh, but in addition to that, um, just if, as for the drawings that I did this week, so at the end of la at last week um, when we did the update, uh, it was the middle of the end of the TRG Coliseum, so I was still drawing uh, pictures for that, uh, mainly, um, Mainly uh, based on um, the Throne Controllers panel that uh, Proton John did uh, at the thing. Come on. So I did like a Wizard of Oz thing. Come on, focus. Focus. There we go. Uh, so I did like a Wizard of Oz thing. <laughs> um, Emil cursing was a great highlight. 
um, and just a whole bunch of other junk. Um, also, obviously, last week John visited, and we got a lot of stuff done. Um, first of all, we did the Superman Let's Play, so if you want to go to the Separate and take a look at Superman 64, it is done. It's completed. It's all up there. Um, but I have a lot of stuff I have to edit now this uh, this week. Um, another thing that I did last last week after John left um, was a Mifa. Um, so it's like a Mifa drawing. Uh, originally, like this was like an original sketch that I don't didn't really like how it was coming out. I didn't really think that it looked particularly good, um, just because of the pose and the eye and proportions. Thank you. Um, but I think this came out just a little bit better. Um, but yeah, so that was that. And then, also, also, um, I got a Zapdos in, in Pokemon Go. It's my first, like, legendary. That's cool. But I, uh, then took the picture and made a digital version, because I've been doing that with all the champions. If you recall, I already did Daruk and, um, Urbosa. But here's the finished Mifa. Come on, focus. Focus, camera. Focus. There we go. So, yeah. I think that came out really well. I really like it. Uh, the, just the colors in general on the Zora are very nice. I, I like the red a lot more than the old Zora colors of, of blue. Um, so I'm going to try to redraw... Uh, some other stuff as well like this, but um, so uh, I just have a volley left on my uh, Champions thing, but uh, yeah, and uh, as always um, The Mifa picture is up on Redbubble if you want to get it on a shirt or an art print or stickers I actually ordered a sticker of that Alima picture that should hopefully be here within like a week or something So you'll get to see what the stickers are like. Uh, I already showed the Severoth one that Christy made but um yeah, so I'm just, uh, um, yeah, if you, if you want to get anything, again, it's the red bubble, but uh, I'm, I'm, I really like how that came out, because I was worried about the Mifa one just because of the, um, like, the her, her headdress um, requires a nice amount of detail, um, and, you know, the shading and everything, you know, to make it look like it's actually there as opposed to just nothing, so... Um, it took a little bit of a little bit of work, but I'm really happy with how it came out. And I didn't need to put in too much detail because that wasn't the style of the drawing, which is really nice. Uh, it's kind of like with Arbosa and and her um, her chest armor. Um, so it was nice. Uh, so I don't know what I'm going to be doing this week. This week I'm probably going to be really busy. I don't know if I'm what I'm going to draw if I'm going to draw, but I'm going to be really busy editing and recording videos because um, again I have the holiday so um i need extra and i don't have any extra right now um but yeah is there anything else going on i saw avengers last night finally emotions happened i'm not going to talk about the movie um because spoilers uh and that's about it so i don't know um Happy Mother's Day, and, uh, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I don't have anything else to talk about, which I guess isn't necessarily a bad thing. It's been a weird bunch of weeks for me. The John's visit aside, you know, old jokes aside there, outside of his visit, it's been a weird bunch of weeks for me, and, um, I don't know if I'm necessarily getting better yet. Uh, it's a lot of ridiculous stuff has been happening to me, but, um, I don't know. It's given me it's given me time to uh, to think about the things I do in my life. So there's that. Um, think about myself also. Um, you know, existential anxieties as opposed to um, anxieties that come from from outside forces. I don't know. Uh, so I don't know. I've done a lot of thinking about myself. Is what I'm trying to say. It's no big revelations, but um, I've. Uh, gotten a better idea of, of who I am, which I guess is a good thing. We'll see, we'll see if that helps me at all in the long run, but, um, uh, I don't know. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, that's, I guess, it, 
Uh, thank you all very much for watching. Thank you all very much for just your support in general. Um, I hope you guys have a good week. I hope that your weather is nice and not like over here where it is really... It, like, I like the rain in the spring, but it, it hurts so much. Um, but yeah, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye, everybody. Bye-bye.